Cyrax. You started this fight. Selling out your clan so Quan Chi would slaughter mine. He should have killed you as he promised. Now I finish what he could not. Fight! <laughs> Anything is possible. Hanzo and I are living proof. Please, don't bring me back as a machine. I can't live like this. Machine or man, you have a warrior soul. As long as I am Grand Master, the Lin Kuei will welcome you. Then until we meet again. Kranika'll get all the service she needs. But I can't quite a fee until I know the job. You will see. Can you restore him? Some frame damage. Circuitry looks good. It looks like someone did a software wipe. Fixing that won't come cheap. Once he is repaired, can he be replicated? Hundreds of times. Thousands. 
That's a tall order. But anything's possible. With the right help. Serve Kronika, and she will provide. Take the deal. Trust me. Otherwise, who can you trust? You weren't kidding. It's like a mirror, reflecting the past. How about that? Over 50 and still a ripper. <clears throat> There's still the matter of our fee. We get paid in the new era. Kronika will make sure the Black Dragon come out on top. Not only in the black market, in every market. Right then, let's get to business. You reach your dad yet, kid? The network's still down. I hate being so far away. Dad must be climbing the walls. Be patient. You'll get through. I know my dad's still alive, but... It's like I'm seeing a ghost. You and me both. But they aren't ghosts. Oh, they're definitely real. Can this get any more bizarre? Come on. Jackson Briggs. Do not fear. I have come to offer you a new life. A better life. That's awfully generous, seeing as we never met. We have not met. But I know you. How valiantly you have served. How horribly you have suffered. That was not my plan for you. Your plan? You were to retire distinguished, not in disgrace. Years from now, General Jackson Briggs. More importantly, your daughter was not to serve, nor endure the same tragedies you have. Your home should be filled with grandchildren. Help me. And it will be. The Tarkatans, long extinct, have also returned. Shao Kahn will seek them out. He relies on their power. Kotal scouts tracked a Tarkatan war party to the Kai Tin's lost hive, Devorah's ancestral home. 
Her hand in Shao Kahn's escape makes that our starting point. Please advise me of what you learn. I must consult with the Elder Gods. When do we leave? Your duty lies elsewhere, Princess. I need you to enlist Queen Shiva. Her support is critical against both Kronika and Shao Kahn. Surely you can... Queen Shiva does not trust me. No Shao Kahn has since my bloody battle with Goro. Shiva's always respected your opinion more than anyone's. When she hears you support Kotal, she'll join us. If that is my duty, so be it. Thank you, Princess. Are you my friend or his consort? It was my idea, Kitana. It's in your best interest. Succeed with Shiva and Kodo will pledge his loyalty to you. There's no bond more sacred to an Oshtek like him. I remember when we could ride like this alone. My life has changed as Outworlds come. Thankfully, you have not. You haven't changed much either, despite the years. You're still the same noble warrior I met in Shao Kahn's court. And now you're Khan. I'm surprised no woman has claimed your bed and become your queen. <laughs> Many have tried. Yet they failed. Why? None of them were you. There are fresh tracks leading into the hive. If Shao Kahn's in there, he'll be difficult to find. The tunnels are endless. Set fire to them. If he's hidden, he will be smoked out. Kotal, we don't know who else is in there. Friendship for anything.